Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today, I'm gonna do a little product review for you guys. I know I haven't really done any first impressions of single products on my channel other than, you know, like quick reviews while I'm doing tutorials, um, just of the random products I'm using. But today, we're gonna be looking at this product that I got sent. Shout out to my friend, Taylor. So, <laughs> If you're wondering why I'm laughing so much, my best friend is sitting right on my bed. Okay, so for today, uh, I got sent these products. This is by the company LipSense. It's by LipSense Cosmetics, and it's their long-lasting liquid lip color. And there's two of these that I got. So the first one is the actual, um, I guess, lip cream or lipstick, lip which... Paint. Lip paint, yeah, I guess. I would, say. I would say it's a lip paint. Yeah, she's right. I got sent the shade Hazelnut, which is more of like this brownie nude. Um, definitely right up my alley because when it looks in the bottle, it looks like a 90s, like, like true tone brown. Yeah, like a mauve brown. Yeah, like a mauve brown. And then you got the Glossy Gloss, Moisturizing Gloss, which is what you're supposed to put on top of the lip cream, lip paint, in order to set it. So... I've never used these before. I'm so used to using, you know, my liquid lips from whatever brand I decided to bust out for the day, but I'm actually really interested to see how these works because it's supposed to look glossy and not budge anywhere. Like, you can eat it. It's kiss-proof. It's food-proof. It's drink-proof. It's whatever-proof. It's earthquake-proof. It's earthquake-proof, you know. Like, it, this <laughs> this ain't going anywhere, apparently. And I've seen a lot of demos on uh, Facebook of uh, people using it, and they're like, this thing is amazing. It doesn't go anywhere. So, we're going to test it out today. Alright, so, the first thing I got in the package was, of course, the two lip scents. The two parts of it. The lip paint and the gloss. And then I also got a card that says thanks from the person that sent it. And another card that has more writing on it. Okay, so obviously, these have a lot of writing on them. And I'm assuming... Oh, it's a note! with instructions. Okay, great. Whoo! Because there was no instructions in there. Like, that, that is empty. This is all that came. So she handwritten... Well, girl, she prepared. She, she, yeah, she wrote down all these steps. Okay, so I'm just gonna read this. So the instructions say, make sure your lips are clean and dry. Apply lip scents in very thin layers. Three layers, okay? So I guess that's for maximum, like, yeah, like for but okay. I, I... Let dry between each layer and don't let the lips touch. I'm like, okay. And then it says, apply in one direction. Don't swipe yeah. the wand back and forth. Yeah. Apply glossy gloss after the third layer has dried. She says the gloss will soak in about up after about 30 minutes and look more matte. Ooh, and she yes. says to make sure... Make sure to gloss before and after eating to preserve the color. Alright, so seems easy enough. So, I guess I'm not going to be using any lip liner with this because I don't think it's going to work if I do. So, I have no lipstick on, no lip gloss or anything, but the only thing I do have on is lip balm. So, I'm going to go ahead and rub it off with just a little uh, wash towel. I use this just to make sure that my lips are nice and exfoliated too. Get rid of any dry skin, any dry patches, and make sure it's just nice and smooth. Plus, it helps to plump up the lips, you know? So, I'm assuming you have to shake it. Like, shake it well, because, yeah, I hear, like, a little... Little ball! So, or I'll there could be... It. So, I'm just going to shake it really good. So, I guess we're just going to dump it and see. Okay, so, the applicator is a nice size, like, dome foot. Oh, wow. Oh, it's cold. Okay. Oh, I got like a tingling sensation going on. Really? Yeah, it's, it's like a it's nice like, color. It's like cold when you put it on, and then it like tingles. That's a really nice color on you. Mm-hmm. You're welcome. So I guess I gotta let it dry for like thirty seconds. It's yeah. a nice color. It is a nice color. I, I like, like it. You. I like the color. It's the color that you would wear. It is. Yeah. So, letting this dry. Yeah, it's dry. It definitely has a tingling sensation. It's interesting. It doesn't, like, hurt or, like, bother you really, but yeah. it, it is tingling. Round three.
Alright, so now now that I think my lips are nice and dry, I, I think they're dry. They feel definitely dry. I'm going to go ahead and put on the glossy gloss or moisturizing gloss, however they said. The card says glossy gloss and this says moisturizing, so I'm just going to pop this on and see if this works. guys see this or not but there's absolutely no color on on the wand even though I just applied it to my lips which is really crazy okay so definitely feels a lot better it's not dried I can definitely feel the moisture which is great because I don't like having super dry lips even when I wear liquid lipsticks so right off the bat my lips feel really nice and moisturized I'm not even gonna lie I'm really really digging the color. First off the bat, the color is phenomenal. Uh, if you guys paid attention, the pigment in this is crazy insane. With just one swipe, there was so much pigment, I was actually really shocked by it. I will say that when you apply this, it does tingle. Like, there is a tingling sensation, but I guess that's good if it's gonna, like, plump up your lips. I don't know if it does because... I exfoliated before I put it on so I, I couldn't really tell the difference but there is definitely a tingling sensation with every layer that you put on but it goes away after around 30 seconds um, these do one this one does have a, a scent to it um, when you open it and you kind of just smell the wand it, it has like I would say you know like when you have a, a perfume and you you put your nose straight towards the nozzle you can smell the alcohol in it, that's exactly what it smells like. It doesn't smell like straight up alcohol. So I'm smelling like a like floral scent along with like the alcohol smell. But if that bothers some of you, I don't think it will be much of a a problem. Just honestly, because when you're putting it on your lips, you don't smell that distinct smell, which is good. So even with this on, I can't smell it. Um, it's just only if I were to smell the wand or the tube. But this one, the gloss has no scent at all. But it feels really nice and moisturizing on the lips. Like straight over this, it really feels moisturized and I really like the feeling. Um, let's see. So we're going to do the, you know, the, the, the test that everyone does where they kind of like move their finger over their lips and see if the product will move. So I'm just going to take finger, obviously, and I'm just going to kind of just move it around. That's freaking amazing. The fact that I can go like, I can move it around. Yeah, There's only the, the gloss came off. The only thing oh, that comes okay. off is the gloss, but that's not something I that's, really mind because yeah. I'm not feeling any difference. Like I don't feel like I pulled off any gloss. It feels really good and I'm really surprised that no pigment came off from the lipstick whatsoever. Um, I will say, looking at it. Try to wipe it off with cloth. You, okay. I guess I'll try. Nada. Nada. <laughs> Nothing came off. That's crazy. Okay. I will say though, looking at my lips, I can definitely see um, where the color does seep into the cracks in my lips, little crevices, and it does kind of settle there. But it's only more noticeable if you were to not have the gloss on, because with the gloss it kind of just smooths everything over. But if you look if I did like a really close inspection, I could really see where it settles into the lines of my lips. And it's not that big of a deal to me, honestly. I don't really mind because, you know, Ain't nobody gonna look that no way. one really is going to look there. Um, it's only noticeable if I kept it completely matte. I am really, really surprised and actually really happy with this product. I'm, I am not BSing you guys. I would never say or review a product to give it a good review just because it came from someone that was um, a friend of mine or someone I know. I always want to be 100% honest with you guys. And even though I got sent one of these, I'm going to honestly say it, these are like good for every single day. Like if this, if you just need one color for the whole day and you don't want to re reapply it throughout, these are it. This is a, from a brand that, you know, is just now kind of going around. So it's, it's pretty brand new. But I think it's, it's really, really cool. I've, I've never had something like this, and I like the fact that I don't have to reapply and that yeah. it doesn't, it actually follows through with its claims that it's long lasting, it's kiss proof, it will not transfer, so I'm very pleased. 
But anyways, guys, if you guys want more information, I will link um, where you can find them down in the description box for you guys. And then I'll also put the links to uh, their Facebook page so you can kind of check them out as well as the person that I got my lip sense from. I can redirect you guys towards her and if you have any questions, feel free to contact her. But I'm well pleased with these and I don't know, I think I would, I would, buy. I would, <laughs> I think I might buy some. I don't know, like I, I really want to try their... There are more darker tones. I've yeah. seen they have some pretty dark tones, so I think oh yeah, they have a black. Yes, yeah, so I think set. I want to give them a try. Oh, I think I might, I think I might buy some more. But anyways, guys, that is the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in my next one. Bye, loves.